Welcome to Northern Lights Over Arkham. I'm JP and this time I'm playing Doctor Strange Protection against Green Goblin Expert. Uh, this combination of the villain and hero was voted on the Facebook community group. So thanks to all who voted. Let's see how the deck looks like after I build it. At the moment Marvel CDP can't publish the Doctor Strange cards because they are still listed as not released. So I'll have this deck list out for a moment so if you want to read through it pause and then continue the video but I'll run through it shortly here. So the deck revolves around playing down a lot of energy resources with uh, enhanced reflexes to power up Nova. There's also the staple energy barriers so that every time I'm taking damage I can reflect it back to the enemies and a lot of usual protection tricks like med teams to heal up your allies and I've also added a couple of indomitables so if I defend and I need to thwart and play um, a card from the invocation deck I can ready and use the indomitable to ready after defending then I can thwart then I can ready up with uh, Dr. Strange's cloak and then play an invocation spell the momentum shift is really useful to deal small amounts of damage and maybe finish off a 3 health minion that has taken 1 damage from an energy barrier for example. You can also heal your hero with it so that you don't have to go to alter ego that much. So. I haven't played this deck so yet, so let's see how it does against the Green Goblin. And we're playing the Mutagen Formula on Expert. So let's get going. If you like my content, hit the subscribe button so you don't miss anything. I've pre-shuffled all the decks, so let's draw our opening hand. So six cards. We get an armored vest. I think I'll keep that. Magic blast. Uh, not sure about that. Energy barrier is quite good at the start. Momentum shift is not that good. Mystical studies. Uh, I think I'll keep it to search for the cloak or the amulet. I think I'll mulligan these three. Okay, we got the cloak, we got also the night nurse and enhanced reflexes. So, we, I've already done the setup for the villain. So, we get on expert two encounter cards right on the first turn. Let's also flip up our invocation deck card, and it is the Seven Rings of Rockador. I'm butchering these names, but bear with me. That's uh, not that useful, so let's start our turn. So I'll use uh, Stephen Strange's ability to discard that. Okay, that looks much more interesting. So, how do we do this? I think I'll... Well, now that I don't need to search for the cloak, I think I'll use the Mystical Studies. Lay down the cloak. There's too many good cards and not no resource cards in the deck, so this starting hand is a bit slow. Yeah, I'll use those cards to play down the cloak. I use these cards. I use the Night Nurse, we don't need her at the start, so uh, I play down 
armored vest. And I'll keep this energy barrier and in hand. I'll flip and I think I will thwart for two for start. Might as well ready and do one damage on the troll. Okay, so that's the first hero phase done. We get four more cards, get the protective ward, momentum shift, Nick Fury and the Eye of Agamotto. So nice cards to have. At least the eye is really good at the start of the game to get it down fast. So let's go to the villain phase. Uh, Green Goblin gets one threat on the main team. He will attack. I will defend. So Uh, 2 plus 1, it's 3, so as I have the armored best down, I take no damage, so we don't need to add threat to the main team. The troll hits me for 1, and let's see the encounter cards, so first one is Goblin Nation. So each goblin has a plus 1 attack. Then we have Regenerate, so no damage is done, so it gains Surge, so we advance, and Green Goblin streams for 3. And the last one is Intimidation. I think I'll give the boost card, so I put it here, so I don't mix it up with the other encounter cards. So that's the first villain phase done, let's go to the next hero phase. Okay, um, would really want to play Nick Fury this turn, but I don't seem to have all enough resources for that. So I think I'll just keep on building my building my board so first thing I'll ready up I will thwart this away I'll play down actually I think I'll play the momentum shift, so I heal two, I only get to heal one, but I deal two damage to an enemy. Let's kill the goblin troll. So I'll keep at least the eye of Agamotto at hand. I'll discard Nick Fury at this point. So we ready up, draw back up to five. Endurance, Energy Barrier, Strength and Med Team. So finally we get some double resources going. And let's go to the villain phase. So Green Goblin attacks, I will defend. Uh, there's one boost card here. So we get two boost cards. So two plus four is six. We ignore three of the damage, so we take three and we got damage, so we add one threat here. And let's get the encounter card. It's a goblin glider. It comes into play. And that's the villain phase. Let's go to the next hero phase. The hero phase starts. Uh, we use the strength to play down. Eye of Agamotto. We will ready. Uh, 
it's 442. Uh, we use Med Team and Eye of Akamoto to play down energy barrier. Keep the endurance in hand, we can play it maybe next turn. And I think that's our turn. We ready up. We draw back up to five. Magical enhancements, power of protection, another energy barrier, and mid team. So let's go to the villain phase. Uh, there's one threat added there Green Goblin attacks. We will defend, so 2 plus nothing, we take no damage, but we add the Goblin Soldier in on the table. And the Goblin Soldier attacks, so we take 1 damage, but we will reflect that damage. And let's just put it on Green Goblin, because I think we might get rid of the Goblin Soldier with the Grimson Bands. <laughs> okay, uh, Encounter card is Assault. Well, this is not very nice. Uh, so, the Green Goblin attacks. We can't defend again, so we take only two damage. Uh, actually, we take 3 damage. And one threat is added here. Okay, so that's the villain phase. Let's go to the next hero phase. I think we need to... Ready up, fort. Uh, actually, let's back up a bit. So, yeah, I'll think I'll. I used the eye of Agamotto to play down magical enhancements first. Then I'll ready. Then I'll thwart. So we thwart for three. Then we could play. I think we'll play down the med team. And I'll right away use it to heal. To the damage on Doctor Strange. And we keep the energy barrier in hand. And that's it. We ready up. And now I have plus one to defense also. So let's draw back up to five. Get the Master of Mystic Arts, Sanct Sanctorum. Downtime and Astral Protection. And let's go to the villain phase. So we add one threat. Green Goblin attacks and we'll defend. 3 plus 2 is 5. So we have defense of 4. So we take 1 damage. And we add one threat here. And the Goblin Soldier attacks. And actually... Now that we have two of these, I'll use one to reflect this so we don't add the threat. And we I think we start putting the damages on this guy. And yeah, we reflected also the damage from the Goblin Soldier. And we get an encounter car, which is another Goblin Glider. It goes onto the Goblin Soldier. And that's the villain phase. Let's go to the next hero phase. 
So I think we will start by healing up Doctor Strange. Let's ready up. Let's hit for two here. Yeah, actually we hit only for one here. Uh, let's play down another energy barrier. And then... I think I'll play the Astral Projection to remove three threats from here. And... I can look at the top card of the encounter deck. It's uh, overrun. So one boost icon coming, so that's not that bad. So we're ready up, we draw back up to 5. Get energy, uh, enhanced reflexes, Mockingbird, Helicarrier, Avengers Mansion and Genius. So just now getting some of our ramp cards up. It's quite a long, long time to wait for some ramping, but I think we're doing okay. So let's go to the villain phase. We add one threat. Green Goblin attacks, we defend. So it's four damage. We reflect one damage here. And the Goblin Soldier attacks, we take one damage and reflect one damage and kill it off. And it deals one damage to us. And the encounter, <coughs> the encounter card is Intimidation, so let's give the Green Goblin a boost card for the next turn. And yeah, this Meditim should have been removed already. Okay, so that's the villain phase, let's go to the next hero phase. So I think I will play down Avengers Mansion this turn. This would be a good time to go and heal up in Alter Ego. So let's use the Eye, use Genius and Helicarrier to play down Avengers Mansion. Let's draw one card. We get Brother Voodoo. Uh, I don't have the resources to play either of these allies, so I'll use them to play down Enhanced Reflexes. I'll ready up. I'll go to Alter Ego and I'll heal 3. And that's it. Um, let's go to the upkeep phase so we're ready up. Drop up to 6. Get Nova. Magic Blast, Magical Enhancements, Enhanced Reflexes, Momentum Shift and Protective Ward. Okay, so the villain phase starts, we add one threat to the main team. Green Goblin gets two boost cards for this um, shaming. So two plus three is five. And that's unfortunately enough to advance. So we put four threat here, and we get an encounter card, which is assault. It gains search, and we put down a goblin troll. Okay, that's the villain phase. Let's go to the next hero phase. We start by drawing a card. We get energy. That's really good. We play down. Uh, yeah, I'll 
slip and I'll put down magical enhancements. I'll use energy to play down enhanced reflexes. I'll use two resources from here and two from hand and I'll play down Nova keep the momentum shift in hand for now I will Work for two, ready, and hit for one here, and Nova will hit for, uh, actually we hit for two with the uh, magical enhancements, and Nova will hit for two and kill off the troll, and we draw back up to five, we get Wong, Indomitable, Astral Projection, and the Power of Protection. Let's go to the villain phase. We had one threat here. Green Goblin attacks. Oh yeah, we need to ready up everything. Uh, I'll defend. I have a defense of four now. So three plus one, we take no damage. We get an encounter card and it is advanced. Goblin Green Goblin seems for 3 Okay That's it, let's go to the next hero phase So at the start of the hero phase we draw one card again We get Master of Mystic Arts Now I think I'll use the Ave Akamoto to pay for the Master of Mystic Arts I'll use Astral Projection and Indominable to pay for it and we do 7 damage to Green Goblin Already I'll thwart for... yeah this has been removed I'll thwart for 2 I'll use the power of protection to play momentum shift so I heal 1 damage and do 2 damage to Green Goblin and I'll keep Wong in hand and draw back up to 5 get Iron Fist, the Sorcerer Supreme an extra encounter card Fury and energy. Uh, we ready up. And we had one threat here. Green Goblin attacks. I'll defend. Six. Minus 3 is 3, so we add one threat here. Encounter card, so the first one is physical toll. Okay, so the next event costs more. We can't do the other one, so. Let's keep it there. 
and shadow of the past so baron mordo enters play we put open the dark dimension in play shuffle this into the encounter deck well that complicates things a lot Okay, that's the villain phase. Let's go to the next hero phase and see how we can deal with all of this. Well, I don't have any events at hand. That's draw one card. Hell carrier. I think we use these to play down Wong. I'll ready up. So there should be one acceleration token here from the open the dark dimension. Oh yeah. We lose this here. Forgot to put that there when it came into play. Uh, I think we need to start stunning. Oh yeah, I played Wong. Actually, I'd rather play Iron Fist. So, I could play Nick Fury also. I'll play Nick Fury. So we don't use that. We draw three cards. Get Med Team and Night Nurse and Mystical Studies. I uh, think we still play Iron Fist. So I use Helicarrier, the Eye of Agamotto, uh, Mystical Studies, and uh, Night nurse. Not there. Here. And we also use Met Team and Wong to play down the Sorcerer Supreme. Then we'll start dealing with the board. So I think we need to get rid of Baron. Mordo as fast as possible. Uh, Nick Fury, Nova, and Doctor Strange will deal with Baron Mor Mordo. And Iron Fist actually has two Mystic Counters on him. So Iron Fist hits Green Goblin and uses. Yeah, there's only two. So uses one Mystical Counter to stun. And he does one plus one damage. Okay, I think that's all I can do. Let's ready everything up. We have a plus one in hand size now in hero mode. Let's get protective ward, master of mystic arts. Magic Blast, Master of Mystic Cards, Astral Projection, and Magical Enhancement. So that's our hand for the next hero phase. Let's start the villain phase. We add two threat here. And Green Goblin doesn't attack. But we get an encounter card, and it is Counter Spell. When I play an event, cancel it and discard this card. Okay, that's actually quite nasty. I think we'll protective ward that, so 
because of this protective word cost three additional resources. I'll use a sharp projection for one mystical enhancement, master of mystic arts and magic blast. Just lose our hand. It's gonna be a slow turn, but we cancel. Uh, we can't do that because that's not a treachery. Oh dear. Okay, scratch that. Just comes into play. So, that's our villain turn, so let's go to the next hero phase. Let's get one card first and see what we get. Okay, so I think I'll play the momentum shift to get rid of all this. That's tying up my event playing. So I'll spend I have Agamotto, Protective Ward, and three other cards. So this gets cancelled, it removes this and also this. And we ready up. Oh yeah, Nick Fury would have left the table already. Uh, I think now I should... There should be one damage on Iron Fist. I should thwart that away, so I thwart for two and one. This gets removed. We shuffle this into the invocation deck. I think we'll pay Master of Mystic Arts with this and pay the images of Icon. So we remove four thread from Machine. I think that's it. We draw back up to six. Protective Ward, Indomitable, Magical Enhancement, Mockingbird, Momentum Shift and Met Team. Okay, that's the hero phase. Let's go to the villain phase. Uh, we had one threat here. Green Goblin attacks, I will defend. 5 damage, I take 2, we add 1 here. And actually I'll reflect one, one of the damage back. Yeah, then we get an encounter card and it is overconfidence. Green Goblin seems, no, Green Goblin attacks. So, Nova will defend. I'll spend this energy resource to deal with 2 damage to Green Goblin. So, Nova gets defeated. And we... And that's the villain phase. Let's go to the next hero phase. 
So we draw one card, Magic Blast. I think we'll advance next turn. Already up, Sword for two. Actually, let's not ward. Instead, I'll I'll hit for one. We advance to stage three. We get three encounter cards. Green Goblin has 20 hit points. So we start hitting the Green Goblin down. Uh, I'll use the Eye of Agamotto and Indomitable and Protective Ward to play down Mockingbird. Actually, I'll keep the protective ward because we're getting so many, so many encounter cards next turn. So we stun Green Goblin. I will play Momentum Shift with the Med Team and Magic Blast. I'll deal two damage, heal two damage. And I think I will thwart for one with Mockingbird. And I think that's it. We ready up. Draw back up to six. We get uh, Astral Protection, Power of Protection, Brother Voodoo and Endurance. Uh, Green Goblin gets one threat on the main team, uh, doesn't attack. And then we see the encounter cards. The first one is Goblin in Troll, gets a Glider. I see you. Green Goblin attacks. Uh, I will defend. So three, four plus. We put a Goblin troll into play. We add one threat here from the attack. Let's see the last card, and it's a Goblin soldier. Okay, so that's the villain phase. Let's go to the next hero phase. Okay, we start by drawing one card from here. Get an energy barrier. I'll think I'll Start by removing the Goblin Troll with Iron Fist. I'll spend this to hit for three. Iron Fist is defeated. This guy goes away. And fortunately, we don't have enough to remove the other one. So I think we need to ready. I'll cast images of icon. I'll spend the eye of Agamotto for it. Crimson bands, really nice to see. 
and we remove four thread from here we will see what the next card is so we boost card will be one boost icon uh, let's play down brother voodoo Oh yeah, actually we wouldn't have seen the card with this, but well, I mixed it up with the astral projection. Well, we play down Brother Voodoo, we search the top 5 cards of our deck for an event card. Uh, now events. And co according to the latest ruling, if you search only a number of cards, you don't shuffle the deck unless the card says, but this card says to shuffle the deck, so we shuffle it. Uh, this is relevant, uh, for example, with the upcoming Hawkeye hero has the Hawkeye Squeaver that searches for the arrows, and you will search the arrows and don't. shuffle the deck afterwards uh, we also put with the power of protection another energy barrier down and i think uh, brother voodoo will also twerk for two and uh, mockingbird will work for one yeah. I think we are safe to go. Yeah, no, we just stay in in this form. So we're ready up. Uh, I'll actually discard the endurance. We get uh, enhanced reflexes, momentum shift, energy barrier, genius, downtime, and strength. That's the hero phase, let's go to the villain phase, so we add one threat per goblin here, so there's three uh, green goblin attacks, a mockingbird will defend, mockingbird is defeated, then these guys attack, I think I'll just energy reflect like so, two damage on this guy. And that's it. Let's see the encounter card, and it is another Goblin Troll. That's the villain phase. Let's go to the next hero phase. We start by drawing a card with the mansion. Let's play down another energy barrier. Uh, Brother Voodoo will thwart for two. Let's play Momentum Shift with the Genius. We do two damage here, and uh, let's hit this troll down. Ready with the cloak, and hit this troll down, and we still have two cards, so we. Pay the enhanced reflexes down. And that's it. Hurry up. We draw back up to f six, so we get Sanctum and Power of Protection. Extra encounter card. Quick shuffle to the deck. I think we're beginning to 
stabilize and hopefully we don't get many guard minions anymore so we can start crimson banding green goblin down so we get magic blast magic enhancement genius one more card and the protective ward okay so we add two threat for two goblin minions green goblin will attack uh, brother voodoo will defend uh, it's another goblin troll cause it is and then the goblin soldier and goblin troll will attack i'll spend these energy barriers and deal the damages on the goblin troll and the other, other encounter actually i Play this in wrong order, so that guy doesn't. Yes, yes, it, it will. This is this was the boost card, right? Yeah. So we get an encounter card. The first one is Goblin Soldier, and the second one is Pumpkin Bombs. So Pumpkin Bombs in play. Okay, so that's the villain phase. Let's go to the next hero phase. Let's start by drawing another card. It's a momentum shift. Nice. I think I'll just hit this guy down. Let's start trying to kill kill off the green goblin. So I'll play momentum shift. I use one from that. Start that, so I deal 2 damage and heal 2 damage. Then I'll Magical Blast. Five. And let's see. It's an energy icon so we deal to additional damage let's see I'll ready up I'll play the crimson bands So 7 damage on Green Goblin, we're 2 damage short, but luckily we have energy barriers down, so we will be able to kill Green Goblin in, on the villain phase. The next phase will be Winds of Watoom, okay, so that's the hero phase, let's ready up and kill the Green Goblin in the villain phase. With the energy barrier, so we draw up back up to six indomitable master of mystic cards, protective ward, and endurance. And the last card is momentum shift. Okay, so we add three threat green goblin attacks. I will for sure defend. Uh, Four plus one is five. I defend for three, so I take two damage, and I'll use the energy barriers to kill off Green Goblin, and I will take the. Well, even if this would trigger, it doesn't matter. So. That was the game. Green Goblin was defeated quite nicely in the villain turn with the energy barriers. I really like protection. I like Doctor Strange a lot too. Well, Doctor Strange is really a strong character to play. Uh, with this deck, I was able to have the board under control quite easily. No big uh, 
problems. The one advance hurt us to advance the act to act two, but nothing, nothing special. So, thanks to everybody who voted for this matchup in the Facebook group. If you haven't, go and subscribe if you like my comment, so you don't miss any game videos. And thanks for watching. Until next time.